Look, 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 look at the camera, Alicia. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, how, how are you, Alicia? I can't, I can't, I can't. <laughs> this girl's so cute. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my gosh, she's so cute. I'm a bloody lens now. Oh my gosh. This is the Harlem shake. I'm a bloody lens. I'm a bloody lens. <laughs> oh, I thought it was so funny. Oh, that's gonna get me 10 million views. Thanks a lot. So right now I'm at the Spice of Life and it's 20 minutes before the open mic and, and at most open mics you'd find that it'd be pretty empty but if we look up the stairs where the queue starts just 20 minutes before we'll find that there's about 25 people here already which is basically the whole less Ford an hour an hour and a half before it starts guys an hour and a half this is why the Spice of Life is so good but massive rant though what's, what's happened to the grand piano? They, they have a new grand piano, but, yeah, but what, what's the situation here? It's not licensed. It's not licensed for the open mic, so they bought a, probably like 10 grand baby grand piano, but we can't use it in open mic. <laughs> All right, so I came to the Spice of Life today and I saw this guy, I was like, wait, I, I definitely remember you. And he was like, no, you don't. I'm like, like crazy piano guy. Like, oh, yeah. I saw you about a year ago. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Place Mario. Look what we found. Yeah. We. <laughs> Back in the days when I used to play Super Mario, I haven't played it ever again. That was very really good. That thank you, thank you. <laughs> Crazy guy. Thanks. Oh. Yeah. It was nice. Oh, look at this lovely food of today. We've got. Ribeye steak with bacon and some kind of descriptive cheese <laughs> with soy sauce and lettuce. Oh my gosh! Oh lord! You may... well, it's, not, it's not. It's not of a lettuce. No. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's broken. Yeah, oh my gosh! But at least we've got a tray full of interesting things to get around our meal tonight. Oh! Look at this beauty! <laughs> TV. This is how they do it. And BBC News, sports, talk about basketball, it, whatever. This is how they do it. We're in a church right now on a far yeah, smaller yeah, scale. We've only got two camera angles, but what we have right is a little knob right here. And if you move it backwards, what you can see is that the TV changes slowly in a nice fade. I have no idea where the camera angle is. Already ready. 
All right, so this is uh, unboxing of Mortal Kombat 10 for Xbox One. A lot of good reviews out there, so I decided to buy the game. Forty pound, not a bad deal. Include some downloadable content. Let's go. Get that knife out. Ooh. Oh, I love this feeling of that fresh smell of unboxing and oh, smell it. Ah. Oh. It's called being a YouTuber. That's what YouTubers do. And that, that, that smell when you undo the plastic. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, and it feels so good, right? The, 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 the feeling of the plastic. You don't understand. You don't. You don't buy your own games. But when you when you earn your money, oh, this, this is so good. Oh, more Combat Ten people, brand new for the Xbox One. Let's open it. That is quite disappointing. Look at that. This, look how ugly that art is. Like a, even like I can make that on paint on my computer. It's ugly. Down over content there. I'll show the codes. And some sort of Mortal Kombat X thing. Whatever that is. And then we've got a disc. And I've, I've realised since the old generation, the discs are actually quite thicker. It's a lovely feeling. I feel like it's going to break. Let's have a look at the back. Let's put this back. Here's the back. It's 18 kids, so kids under 18. Don't play this kids at home. That was an unboxing of Mortal Kombat 10. For any more news on Mortal Kombat 10 or anything, call of duty, stay locked to IGN.